Hey, Alicia here. If you're new to my guide, be sure to subscribe. If you already have, tap the bell button to stay updated. Let's just say I'm key obsessed. I've been starting to collect them over the last six months and I'm already at eight pairs. I only have two eyeballs where they do that at, but I just love the fun and expression you can have with a pair of sunnies. So I'm going to share with you why I love each pair. And if you like any of these, let me know in the comment section below and let's get into it. Let's start off with the latest and we'll go back from there. These are my newest pair. They are the Desi Key Collection and they always come in this plastic, I don't even know, container, cover. So it's got the snap there. I kind of wish it was something more oomph because of how much you pay, which I'll talk more about at the end. But I guess it's fresh and fun and it's very shake a game. These are the high key minis. When high keys came out, what, last summer or summer before, I really wanted to get into it, but I didn't think it was worth the money to get a pair of frames that would take over my whole face. Small face squad right here, cheer captain. I love these because they are way smaller. I think they're about a few inches. Okay, maybe nine inches, that's a little bit much. But they're quite a bit smaller than the OGs. It screams bronze goddess. It is copper fade with the rose gold. I love it, I love it. Most of the other keys come in this case. So it'll say Key Australia and have your sunglasses slide out. I don't know why they don't come with cleaning cloths. You should come with cleaning cloths, Key. These are called Can You Nods. They're my second newest pair. And I was on the fence when these came in the mail because you know how things look good on the model and then when you try them on, you're kind of like, um... I grew to love these. I love them for the reason why I love them on the model. They have a very futuristic, slightly oversized, but very oversized on my face look to them. The purple lenses are so pretty and they're not too dark, which is very important for me because I live with Stargardt's disease. The word on the street with these are that cat eyes are back and maybe that's why they're called hearsay. I love the gold detailing at the corner of the tortoise shells. I love how tortoise shells just add a little extra something to a frame. I do wish the lenses were a little bit darker because I like when people don't know where you're looking. Is that just a me thing or do you like that too? Might be the smallest sunnies, but definitely the biggest statement. Showdowns. The name is so extra, but I love these. These definitely make a statement whenever I wear them. I have yet to wear them the way I want to, which is as an accessory for swimwear. Like if you're doing an OTD and you got your bikini on, I haven't gotten there yet. But I've worn these fully clothed and I feel like they do add a little sum something to whatever I wear. And I like to wear them at the tip of my nose, like I'm the wolf front and like I'm the grandma in the little red riding hood. These ones are my favorite pair of shades. They're everything I ever wanted. The only thing I would say is I wish the Tortoise was more black and white like it was online. It came out more gray and black, but besides that, I love these. These have to be one of my favorite pairs of sunnies. They're second to my Celine's because Celine's. And I love the round frames with the perfect reflective of gold, and they're small, so they fit my face perfectly. On trend with the plastic frame look, these are the Don't At Me from the Desi Key Collection. I am here for these. They give me invasion of privacy vibe. I've seen a ton of brands try to do the whole Cardi B look, and I feel like these are the closest to that album cover. They're spot on, they're so extra, and they add just the right amount of sass to whatever I'm wearing. We're getting very close to the end here. These are the second pair I ever purchased. I got them from Nordstrom. They're called the Saharas from the Desi Key Collection as well. This is like wearing a Visco cam filter, straight up because when you wear these, you feel like the world is painted in hues you've never seen before. I love them so, so, so much. Right, last and classiest, these are the French Kiss. I decided for my very first pair, I wanted something that I would never ordinarily wear because I was buying these for my trip to Mexico. The reflective lens, which I've only had experience at this point with one other pair, which I wasn't too fond of, but I love how reflective, this is like a mirror. My friend actually used this to fix her lipstick when we were on vacation. I love the bar over here. I love the slight cat eye. It is oversized, but it works with my face. These were just the perfect introduction to key, I feel. Like you gotta go big or go home when you're trying an online brand, especially when you're gonna pay a pretty penny. I got these from Nordstrom, so the only good thing was the prices and everything was conglomerated, is that the word? They were just compiled together. Now talk about the price. If you're a Canadian consumer like myself, be warned, whatever the price is on Key Australia, just times two. Because once you add in the exchange rate from Canadian to US dollars, which is really hefty right now, online shopping has never been the same. Adding the duties, the taxes, the $10 handling fee that DHL decides they need. 
it usually ends up being double to the prices, which you might think is expensive, but I do think these are good quality and things tend to be expensive here in Toronto anyway. So getting a funky pair that you're not gonna see everyone else wear, I feel like it's kind of worth it. But with that said, I need to scale back. Not saying there won't be a part two to this video maybe in a year where I have eight more bears because let's be real, it's a problem. But it is something that I kind of have to watch because I'm breaking the bank here and it's a lot of coins. But I do love them. I hope you love them too. Let me know what your favorite shade was. If you have a pair of few, let me know what they are in the comment section below. And if you're looking into getting your first pair of Key Sunnies, tell me what they are too. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And until next time, love and later. This brawn goddess, bronzed, bronzed. These were worth every penny and they're the same shade as a penny too. Very on trend. These are on trend. On trend. What are you saying? I'm saying. I ended up persaging, persaging, persaging.